Super Hikiyami Moriko Turbo HD Remix. Hello, Minasan. Hikiyami Moriko this, and welcome to another indie game. This one's called The Clean Sources, and it's by the developer uh, Soseki. And this is this is also a game for the Scream Jam 2024. So let's just start Clean Next Sources I guess. I love the color scheme of this game already. These are my colors, so I love it. Uh, no controls. How do I how do I even oh okay WSD jump with spacebar I guess that's all I do Q E yeah What do I have to clean extra E to read This is really this is a really weird sign Okay very helpful thank you I love the music by the way really cool um, um, hide Oh boy that many eyes and you cannot see me? Oh god! Ah! <laughs> oh, 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 damn it! I'm gonna die, I'm terrible at this game. Ah, oh, damn it, I'm dead. Wait, I'm not dead, I'm dead now. Okay, I'll try again, I'll try again. I don't quite get what I had to do. I think I have to press it a bunch of times in quick succession, probably. I'll try again. I wonder if I can jump over the monster. Oh! Alright, okay. Alright, alright. Oh boy! Let me hide, let me... Okay. There's a number one there and a number two here. Ah, oh, come on, come on! Wait, what? I'm, I'm slightly confused by how this game works. Um. There's no way of killing the monsters. I guess not since I have to hide, right? Uh... Ah, come on! They come running for me. Oh, come on. What am I even supposed to do in here? I'm dead. I'm gonna read the each of your page. I don't understand what I have to do. Do you go to this weird house that you need uh, uh, that need your service and cleaning service, but there is a weird floating ball of ice annoying you to death, literally? Utilize the hiding spot and finish the cleaning before you die and redo the whole thing. Good luck. It's better to download the executive blah, 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 blah. Tips the tip the objective are near the numbers. Okay, so that those are the numbers. But that's about it, but can you at least respawn me close to the like on the last room I cleaned? Doing the, the entire thing doesn't feel that good. And that thing is too fast! Yeah, they don't let me do anything! Are we sure this game is its balance? Ah, damn it! How did it die?
I just have to wait for them to like die or something. Ah, damn it. This is <laughs> okay. This is all I can do within the time limit of the Scream Jam 2024. Thank you for playing. Okay. Now 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 the difficulty setting makes sense to me. Let me have fun with the with the physics of the game a little bit. All right, so it was a really short game. Now I understand the difficulties. I was like, how many levels do I have to play in a row without dying? Like five, 20. I have play played games like that before, right? Well, where you have to play like five, 15, 20 levels in a row because if you die, you start from the beginning. And I like, what, why did developers do that? I don't understand, but I understand in this one, right? So it's a really short game. I mean, it's a nice idea. I like it. I think still, maybe... What could be done for this game? Obviously the problem was time, as usually it is with game jam games, right? I've been there myself. Making games for game jams, it's truly something... I like the physics of these things, but maybe they should be a little bit, like, heavier, because you end up, like, tilting them. Which maybe it's the intended purpose, I don't know. Um, yeah, so this was a really really short game. I was expecting a little bit more But yeah, I like the concept of cleaning maybe if you could have like A debuff for the like can you slow down the ghost even if you cannot kill them can you slow them down with something? I don't know uh, What else could be done with this game? Obviously different types of ghosts with different types of behavior obviously I think maybe smashing for cleaning, it's not the best. Maybe, like, if you just hold the, the, the button, it's, it's good enough. And maybe you can make the, the, the sprite darker when you're in hiding, so it's more obvious when you are in hiding and when you're not. Maybe that, but otherwise I think it's a pretty solid game. I mean, it's visually impressive. I love the pixel art in this. The music, it's really good. It's getting better. The music, it's just getting better. So yeah, I think I don't have a lot to say about this game. It's really, really short, but it's also really, really good. I just, I just think if anything, it needed more content. But again, game jam game, right? So let's just go to the main menu, and I think that will be all for Clint Kling Kling Sources. How do you say this? Kling Sources. Uh, so if you guys want to try the game, the link will be down in the description with all the games I have played so far. Thank you guys for watching, thank you developer for making the game, and I will see you guys in the next indie game, stream, or whatever I decide to do with this channel in this spooky season. I'll see you later.